today I just got in my Scotch Advanced Tape Glider and I thought I'd do a little comparison between the Scotch ATG 714 which I've had a while. It's uh, had some wear and tear on it. Uh, much loved. Um, anyway, and I have... I have a scale that will weigh to an ounce, and I weighed both of these. Now, this one is empty, and empty, it weighs 12.7 ounce, 12 ounces, and the red ATG, which has, um, I've used about half of the roll of adhesive, and it weighed 13.5. I then weighed the kind of tape that is in my 714, and it weighs right at one ounce. So, uh, they weigh the exact same, these two. I find absolutely no differences between the new pink ATG and the original ATG 714, except for these can be found in some local... Um, crafting stores where th this you have to order from a heavy duty framing company and these you can probably use your coupon for and get for much much cheaper. Uh, it was rumored that it was going to be made out of a lighter weight plastic. Um, I'm not seeing it. They weigh exactly the same. And this one comes with two of the Scotch uh, acid free photo safe rolls, 36 each for 72 yards. Now I also have the ATG 50. Um, I bought this one for my daughter, who's actually only six, but uh, kept using my other one and we were swapping back and forth. And Anyway, uh, some of the differences between um, these, between the, the ATG 50 and these two it weighs the same. It's about um, half of the usage, although I've had to take off some because it will ravel, it'll get all raveldy or what well, I can't think of the word, um, squirrely. It gets all messed up around there. And another thing, it, it loads differently. It loads uh, backwards to me, the um, other ATG uh, guns roll this, uh, load this way. Also, um, when you're using it, the, this is actually on this edge, so you're using it, and I can kind of see where my tape is going to go, where this is a little bit harder, because it's actually on the inside. But other than that, this has been a really great deal, or it was a great deal, because it cost me considerably less than the ATG 714. However, now it's very comparable to the advanced tape glider. Um, one other thing I thought while I had, um, had it and it was empty, I would go ahead and load, load it up to show you how I do that. Just snap it on. Oh, another thing about the ATG, the blue... Um, blue one, you have to make sure that you have it all the way down, because if you do not, then it, it will not work properly. I, 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 these are so much easier to load, in my opinion. Okay, so you just uh, click it underneath the snap there, uh, loop it through. This It does come with instructions. Take it around there, loop it through. It's not wanting to stay. I don't even know if you can see it at this angle. Click the button so it'll turn. And I always forget to replace that. Close it up and it should be ready to go. Let's see if I can find something to get here. Perfect. It's going to stay stuck. 
Anyway, that's all for now. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, you can post them, and I will get back with you as soon as possible. And if I don't know the answer, I'll try to find the answer. And also, please be sure and visit me on my website, hidinginmycraftroom.com.